Or the Illinois Attorney General is threatening to sue the federal government over the Foxconn development. It comes the same day Governor Walker traveled across the state to help deliver an announcement from Foxconn. Charlotte Deleste is in the news center with that. Charlotte? A lot of news about Wisconsin Valley here. The Illinois Attorney General plans to file a lawsuit challenging a recent rule issued by the U.S. Environmental Protection Agency reducing the number of areas in Wisconsin that needs to meet more stringent ozone regulations. Now, Racine County, where the plant is located, is subject to stricter air pollution guidelines. The Illinois AG says the EPA is putting, quote, a company's profit ahead of our natural resources and the public's health. Well, from Black River Falls to Brownsville to Racine, Foxconn, their construction manager and the governor shared the news that 28 companies have been chosen to do initial construction on the manufacturing plant. 27 are from Wisconsin, the other is from Rockford. It's being touted as Wisconsin's Foxconn bonus. The largest economic development project in the history of the state, one of the largest projects in the history of all of America, is right here in southeastern Wisconsin. Our, our connection with case The companies will be responsible for erosion control, well, mass excavation, stormwater management, and testing work. Foxconn says the contracts awarded to the 28 companies are worth $100 million and will create 800 direct and indirect jobs. None of those companies are from our area. This is just the first phase of the Foxconn development. Mark and Susan. All right, Charlotte Tillis, live in the news center. Thank you. Gina.